what is up guys back with another one and i haven't done a movie review in a while so i actually went to go see that new movie Terra yesterday and i saw it with my boy jay and honestly i'm just gonna start right off the bat by saying i don't know how to feel about this movie because i went into there thinking all right it's gonna be a pretty damn horrible movie and throughout the movie i kind of laughed more than i got scared but calling it a horrible movie uh, just wouldn't really sit like well with me because I think you should at least go see it for yourself. I wouldn't call it good. I did, like I said, I laughed way more than I got scared. And literally, um, I don't know, just the whole concept of it to me was pretty like stupid at first. But then they got a little bit more into it and like started trying to tell a story behind it. And I was like, all right, I guess these tarot cards just aren't just coming to life. Like there's a purpose behind it. So kind of gave me a little bit of clarity right there with the um making it make a little bit of sense but the characters are very very horror like when you go see a horror movie and like you're just like oh that's so cliche they're gonna run down there they're gonna, they're gonna do this they're gonna do that all these characters are like that times 10 like seriously these guys are so dumb they literally like know what is ha like know what they need to do to stay alive and they're just like nah I'm trying to die today. And then, like, they just... Yeah, it's crazy, bro. Like, it's insane. So, honestly, I want you guys to go ahead and, like, check this out. Either if it's free, comes to the TV, or if you just have a little bit of extra money and you want to go with your friends. Just go check it out. And the fact that they had the dude from Spider-Man in there, Ned, I was just... I was just, like, mind blown. I, I honestly needed those because he... He's usually like kind of a nerdy guy in Spider-Man and this one they made him play the stoner. So he's just like getting high, being like dumb, saying like the dumb little shit. But honestly, like he, I hate stoners in movies because they make stoners like look bad as hell. Like they just sit there smoke and just like, yeah. And I'm just like, what the, f like, like bro, no one acts like that. But literally, I don't know. Um, the main characters, the uh, two main protagonists, like the girl and the guy, I don't know their actor names, but I thought they were pretty cool. Like, um, the guy is more of a, like, known actor to me. Uh, I didn't know the girl too much, but I think it's definitely, like, I don't know. They definitely had, like, the right cast. They just didn't have, the, like, the right script. And I think it's just because one of the, um, I was watching the Penguin Zero thing last night, and he was saying that one of the directors, like, made like horrible movies so i was like oh that makes sense if it was like a bunch of directors that like kind of sucked them hey it's not on the actors man but hopefully they can still pull some like cool little jobs after this movie because it was really like predictable like everything i think every death i guessed like i sat there and i was like i think this might happen and then literally it happened and i was like okay but other than that like it was pretty cool like i like I liked the the small little bit of concept they gave to it. The graphic images were, like, cool, I guess. Like, the characters were made <laughs> made dope. It wasn't scary. It was just more, like, um, more just, like, cool to see, I guess. Like, the, the idea of it. Because tarot cards are pretty, like, common for everybody to just be using and stuff. So, I think it would have, like, kind of set this little, oh, do I even want to start using tarot anymore? Like, this is so creepy. But... Honestly, I'm not really a big fan of tarot cards. Uh, I think it's a whole bunch of baloney. Um, yeah, but I'll probably be the one dying and being like, oh my god, my tarot card was right. Um, other than that, the movie was probably a good 6 out of 10. So, if you want to go check that out, go check that out. Let me know what movies I should see next. Uh, Planet of the Apes is coming out soon. Fall Guy, I might go check that out. I need to start busting out a little bit more of these movie reviews because I have been seeing movies. I just been getting lazy, and with back like piggybacking off of that, um, moving forward, it's just gonna be me. Uh, yeah, I'm uh, honestly just single again. I don't want to talk about it, but uh, I'll be doing good. I'm gonna try to work on focusing, making these videos a little bit better because the reason I kind of didn't edit all the time was just because I was like lazy and then like. Being in the relationship would just be like, oh, I just want to like lay here with my significant other and all that stuff and just not do, <laughs> not edit this. I'd rather just post it raw, but I'm going to probably just try to edit a little bit better and do a little bit better stuff for the channel because it's time to focus on myself, man. 
got to get a little bit farther with this. I want to hit 200 subs. We have like 30 more subscribers to hit. Um, yeah, that's why the shorty shorty video was not good. Because I was having like a bad day that day. And, uh, I didn't even put an intro. I didn't put an ending. I just recorded what I could for that. And I just like posted it. Because I, I wasn't having a good day that day. So, um, yeah. Moving forward. I'm going to do this. Just us. And I hope you guys stay tuned. Subscribe. And yeah. Keep up with the process. My bad for my low energy. I'm trying to build back up. Obviously, like I just said. Like going through a lot of stuff right now. So. Yeah, I'm trying, man. See you guys in the next one.